What's up everybody, Chef Lego Alex here, and today I will be showing off character number 3 for my Nicktoons minifigure pack. To be truthful, I wanted to show off this minifigure as part of my Nick Jr. CMA, but due to timing, I just had to wait. But our minifigure is Doug from Doug. Doug was one of the first Nicktoons alongside Ren and Stimpy and Rugrats, but later got owned by Disney, so let's say Disney also proved for Doug to return. He has a new headpiece similar to Darth Maul, and his accessories are a pencil and journal. I consider this a coincidence as this week Sora got announced for Smash Ultimate as the final DLC fighter, so Disney can approve for both. <laughs> Alright guys, that does it for this video. Actually, why don't I show you guys minifigure number 4? For the appropriate timing of Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl, the next minifigure is... Lucy Loud from The Loud House. Again, I acknowledge fans asking for Loud House content for so long, so I thought I'd throw in the next Loud family member, and that being Lucy. I think she's a fan favorite to many, including mine, so I thought I could throw her in. She has the bangs hairpiece, as well as two accessories, a bat and a candle, and she also has Poppy's skirt in black, so a new color. Overall, she was a very easy character to draw, and I really can't wait to draw more Loud House characters in the future. Alright guys, that concludes the video for the two reveals for my Nicktoons minifigure pack. Post in the comments area below and your thoughts about Nickelodeon and Star Brawl, which I've been playing and it's such a great game. I hope to see what the future holds, but for now, let us enjoy the game and prepare for future DLC. I have my money on blue. Okay, realistically, Jimmy, Timmy, Jenny, and Manny are characters I want to see. But what are yours? Do also take a guess on which minifigure will be shown next this November. Till next time guys, bye!